are trying a little bit of midday road cruising after finding a dead rattlesnake in the road yesterday midday that seemed pretty freshly hit. This is a disheartening sight, but it's in a way a good sign with that cold front that came through a few days ago. I wasn't sure we were going to see much, and this is a Great Basin rattlesnake that looks like it just got hit in the middle of the road. I, I've already removed it from the road, and we're already moved to the side for safety's sake, but I'm really hopeful we get the chance to see a live one. It is a windy day, and we came back to the same stretch of road where we found a dead rattlesnake yesterday. Upon arrival, we found another dead rattlesnake. So we decided to park it and kind of explore the immediate area. As I was exploring, Desiree happened to actually see this one in the road, so thanks to my wife, because I was over there somewhere, this thing was crossing the road, and for all we know, a car could have come by, and this rattlesnake could have met his end, but this is the Great Basin Rattlesnake, native to southern Utah. It's a really, really beautiful little animal, and I'm really glad we got our chance to see one today. So, since I had this little tiny baby snake hook, I'm going to use my hat and get him in my hat move him across the road in the direction he was headed. Be sure to click on the thumbnails provided to join Michael on some of his full-length herping expeditions and visit us on the web at www.camochairproductions.com for all our latest outdoor adventures. Hope to see you there.